So this is our factory where we make pellets. And uh, we will do the test for you as you requested. So the machines are not working in the moment. There are pellets which we made yesterday. Mainly we make pellets from sawdust. You can see we have got quite a lot of good sawdust. And now I'm walking towards the big bag you've sent us. This is your material. I believe it's this one. Which you sent to us. And uh, let's have a look what's inside. So we can see your biomass. Unfortunately at the moment it's not the way we need it. You can see there are quite big particles. Big pieces of biomass which uh, obviously are not fulfilling the requirement that the biomass needs to be shredded up to four millimeters maximum of um, of size so we will shred it again and then uh, we can make the tests for you just for your understanding this is the die matrix you push the material through this die and you get the pellets on the other side so you can imagine this is six millimeters die and obviously you can see why the size of your material it's not acceptable. How can you push such a big piece through those little little holes? The material needs to be like dust, sawdust. So we will shred it now and then show you how the material looks differently and it will give you much better results instead of stopping the machine every time. This is more likely what we would like to see. Yeah, nice. You can get nicely through the die. So now we will transfer it to the machine and see what we get out of it. And another very important requirement for the biomass is that it's uh, dry. Uh, other pages say it should be up to 12% of moisture content. We have got a proper moisture meter here and we can have a look how much moisture your material has got. As you can see, it's 17.9. We can measure it again, please which is far from uh, required 17.2 so obviously you can make pellets from this kind of biomass but it's not uh, what it should be and so there is the happy moment we're getting some pellets
just to introduce you our machine briefly so this is your that's your biomass which we put into the hopper here and uh, from the hopper it goes up and down that's the material shifting this is where all the palletting is happening. This is the pallet press. System. The pallets are getting down there, getting cooled and separated from the dust. 